Hi, David Dodge here for Green Energy Futures. Today we're at Edmonton's world-class waste management facility to learn how they use landfill gas to make electricity. Come on in, let's go have a look. Neil Burkhard is a public education specialist with the City of Edmonton, and he's our guide to green energy production at this amazing landfill. This is the Clover Bar Landfill. It's made up of 34 years of Edmonton's garbage. It's so large that we're standing several stories above the ground. We're so high up that you can see the buildings of downtown Edmonton right over there. 20 years ago, the city of Edmonton realized that this landfill could either be a liability as a major source of greenhouse gas emissions or a source of energy and electricity. Let's go and have a look at one of the landfill gas wells. Underneath my feet, you'll find all that landfill gas. It's mostly made up of carbon dioxide and methane. The methane is 21 times more powerful as a greenhouse gas. So let's come up with a really good idea in how to use that gas for something useful. How about we turn that methane into electricity? About 60 wells and a spider web of pipes are used by pumps to literally suck the methane gas out of the landfill. About 4% of Canada's equivalent CO2 emissions come from landfills. Currently, there's 60 active wells that we're drawing landfill gas from. 20 meters below the surface, there's a star network of pipes connected to this cleaning shaft. From here, all of that landfill gas goes over to the landfill gas plant. As Neil drives us down off the mountain of trash, we meet up with Mike Lefebvre. He's the landfill gas plant operator for Capital Power. We're looking at the Clover Bar landfill gas generating station. And what we do here is we take methane from the landfill, bring it in through, through a process in this building, uh, prep the gas, bring it over to a generator, a diesel engine which has been converted over to natural gas, uh, which turns it into electricity, which is then provided to the grid which people in uh, the city of Edmonton use. This 4.8 megawatt power plant can power 4,600 homes. It's not just the energy that's produced, however. There are significant environmental benefits to capturing and burning landfill gas as well. Taking all the methane from the landfill and turning that into a source of electrical energy is really good for the environment. So we're not venting all that methane into the atmosphere. We're taking about three quarters of the methane and turning that into a source of electricity. There are 64 landfill gas recovery operations across Canada and their efforts reduce greenhouse gas emissions by 6.9 million metric tons of carbon dioxide equivalent each year. In an energy hungry world and a world concerned about climate change, it would make a lot of sense to take all these landfills across our country and take that methane and turn that into a source of energy to meet that demand. Edmonton's waste management facility already diverts 60% of its waste to recycling and composting. The next big thing is a biofuels plant that will take waste diversion in Edmonton up to 90% by 2015. Check out our photos, blog, and podcast at greenenergyfutures.ca. We'd love to hear from you. Check out our Facebook page or send us a tweet or email. Thanks for watching. For Green Energy Futures, I'm David Dodge. <laughs> That's right. Landfill. Oh, landfill. Landfill. Oh, landfill. <laughs> okay, let's uh, let's wait for the plane. Yes, actually, and uh, 